Just one point separates the top two teams over in the end of the as PSV close the gap on leaders Ajax. But what's going to happen this week when the two sides lock horns? We'll take a little look. Next. Video today, we look forward to match number 10 over the eight of late on the shade at the Vizze. That's right, we'll get to that in just one second. Of course, if you're new, where you've been, smash your subscribe button. Keep your bang out today with all things touch football related, plan for nose related. We got it all here, boys. And we're not very well we're under the weather a little bit, but we've got to keep on soldiering on, keep the predictions coming. Of course, as the football does, keep on bloody coming. Uh, we'll take a look at the latest round of picks in just a second. Big big shout out to my VRPs, the LPPs, boys and girls. You know who you are. Special shout out to you guys. You are the VRP. The, the, the oil in the frying pan. That's what you guys are. Whatever that means. Anyway, if you want to help us out in another way and you want to become the latest and best mate for life, check out the links down below, picture.com forward slash Robesy. But anyway, here we go. Uh, we're going to recap the games that did take place this past weekend. All right, yeah, folks, let's take a little look back at the games that did take place this past weekend. Then shall we take a little look at it? Fine odd. Uh, played RKC. Wow, they picked up a 2 2 draw. Only a 2 2 draw. Bit of a shocker there. Meanwhile, go with the Eagles. Smashed past Hercules Ambolo. 4 2 win in the end uh, to give themselves a big old boost up to where are they? I don't even know where they're in the table at the moment. Uh, SCC had me lost to Ajax, of course, they did. Uh, just the one defeat so far for Ajax as they top the pops. Uh, Fortuna Sedad uh, beat Cambor. Uh, good win for them. Of course, PSV, I know it did beat PEC Zvola to, of course, move to just one point behind Ajax. Of course, AZ Almar are on the charge again. Four wins, four defeats, though, this season. 5-1 win. Demolition over Utrecht, who, of course, are in third right now. NEC Nyman did lose to Vietis Arnhem. 1-0 win in the end. Big win for Vietis as they also move the chains. Sparta Rotterdam, 1-1 draw with Groningen. And FC20 also a 1-1 draw against Wilhelm Twain. Uh, I'm not really looking at my picks because I think I did pretty shit. I got two, three, three, three. I got three. Pretty garbage, really. We'll take a look at your picks in a minute. This is the table right here, right now. I actually the charge with one point clearance over PS 40B. At the foot of the table as well, and they are going down. Sparta and Grudigan could be joining them uh, as, of course, the uh, relegation uh, discussion heats up a little bit. Let's kick on forward and take a look at how you guys got on. Of course, the three would have got me last with Kevin, Shevin, and Ivan String. But of course, Hans Worst, Yanni Buster, Shane Adon, and Tom Stater kicked off. Kicked some real ass, some Dutch ass there, and got himself six out of nine so well done to you guys uh what about the overall grand scheme of things well here it comes in all its glory uh it's nana cam and tom stinger lead the charge at the moment in the dutch with 47 points so far winky breathing down the next russell frost of course he's in the mix as is shown on yannick buster in the power five but they can all change this time around over in the air of a so let's kick forward and take a look at the next round of matches but before that here is the link if you want to get involved if you're new to the scene of course we're deep 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 in the discussion for predictor of the month who's going to be in charge we'll see of course at the end of the month here. Uh, but let's get into the next round of matches. Let's jump in and have a look, shall we? I've got, as of course, the kicking off with Wilhelm Tway against Fortuna Sittard. This coming Friday. That's October the 22nd. They played on the 25 times. It's 995. 11 wins for Wilhelm. 8 wins for Sittard. Of course, 6 draws. Beats for Wilhelm. 4 0 win. The beast other way was a 4 1 win. Uh, Wilhelm competition just won to beat the past 6 games. Meanwhile, Sittard just won win in the past 6 games. 25% form compared to the 67% form of Wilhelm. Uh, of course, coming at you last time, over at the uh, uh, Wilhelm 2 stale, Wilhelm Sway Tway. Stadium was a 2 1 win back in May 2021. The Away side hasn't won this game since Wilhelm beat Sidal on the reverse fixture way back in 2019. Let's take a look at the recent encounters then, shall we? Or recent matches. Of course, Wilhelm coming to the back of that a draw against 20. Sidal uh, coming to the back of that win against Cambor. The odds on this one go in favour of the host. 11 to 10 on for the victory. 45 is your away win. And 35 is your draw. Going to go with the home win on this one. Wilhelm Tway to make it back to back wins, is it? No, at least uh, unbeaten in the last two games. I'll kick it off though. It's P.E. Season Waller who are struggling up against Hercules Armelo. Uh, getting into this one then, shall we? At the end, Mac three park stadion taking place on saturday of course coming at you they showed 22 times in 2004 10 wins for amalo seven wins for swallow and five draws of course the biggest win for zvola was a two-nil win the biggest win the other way it was a four-nil win uh coming at you of course amalo winning three losing three in the last six 50 percent form up against swallow just one draw the past six eight percent form for them absolutely shitty form at the moment last time they that over in zvola of the two-two draw back in uh in january 2021 zvola did lose to our psv last time around meanwhile amalo lost to uh go at eagles last time around uh heading into this one of course amalo doing uh, Oh, 
all right in 12th. Uh, as for Zwolle, they're down into 18th. Look at the odds on this one. Man to five is your host. 29 to 20 is your away win. 23 to 10 is your draw. The away win, uh, the away team is your favourites. I've gone with them as well with a 2 to win to take it to the house. FC Utrecht will take on Enemien this weekend. Uh, also on Saturday, October 23rd. They've been each other 63 times since 1993. 24 wins for Utrecht. 22 wins for Hedervin and 17 draws, of course. Utrecht coming to just one defeat. That's five for them. 58% form up against Hedervin. Just one win in four. Uh, 42% form for them at the moment. Uh, of course, their biggest win over each other, the respective two sides, with a 4 0 win over each other. Uh, of course, that's another picture over in uh, Utrecht with a 1 1 draw uh, back in the October 2020, right about this time last year. Uh, of course, uh, Utrecht did get spanked by AZ Outman last round. Hedevin also uh, got beat by Ajax last time round. Odds on this one. What do we have on this? We have Utrecht at 50 to 8 on the direction 10 to 3 is draw. 90 to Borja away when that's Helen Bean. So the host side your favourites. I've gone with the hosts as well on this one. 3 1 win to take it to the house. Uh, FC 20 will take, take on NEC Nijmegen uh, down at the uh, uh Vesta. That's right. This coming Sunday. Pleasure of the 49 times since 1994. Uh, 20 minutes unbeaten in the last six. 83% form up against uh, Nijmegen. Just one win of the past six. 25% form for them at the moment. Uh, of course, the mixed win over each other. So of course, with them both a 4 0 win. Uh, of course, coming at you last time around, though, over in. Uh, in uh, that was a 2 0 win for, for 20 back in December 2018. The Wasters hasn't won this game in a long, long time. We're talking about uh, last time was back in 2014 when 20 beat Nijmegen in the reverse fixture on this one. Uh, of course, 20 did draw back to back draws, in fact, uh, for them. Of course, joining with Gruningen and joining with Wilhelm Twain. We were Nijmegen coming to the back of that loss against VT's Arnhem. Odds on this one, we have 20 11 8 off of the victory, 11 4 draw, 7 2 is your way win. That's nine, Megan. I'm going with my boys to my Dutch cheese. That's right. Two to win for the 20 to get the win. And of course, keep on moving. Uh, Wildwick will take on. Who are they going to be taking on? They're going to be taking on Sparta Dam. Uh, of course, this coming uh, Saturday, this one. Um, these two sides go to my ass. Play sure three times since 93. 14 wins for Wildwick, 16 wins for Sparta, and nine draws. Big spin for Wildwick, 5 1 win. The big spin the other way was a 4 0 win. However, Wildwick coming to Spinata win in six. Meanwhile, Sparta just one win in six. 42% form. Uh, both sides coming to this with a lot of draws knocking around. Uh, looking at this one last time around, over in Wildwick was a 2 0 win for Sparta. They're actually unbeaten against uh, Wildwick for a few games, going all the way back, all the way back to 2017 and the KNDB Becker when Wildwick picked up the 1 0 win. Uh, of course, Wildwick coming to the back of that draw against final on me. Meanwhile, Sparta coming to Back at that draw against Grudigan. Look at the odds on this one. We have uh, 31 to 20 is your, 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 your no, uh, what are we looking at? 31 to 20 is your Warwick. Uh, 31 to 20 is also your Sparta. And 5 2 is your draw. Tight, airtight this one. I'm going with the one who win for the away team on this. Cambor will entertain final this coming Sunday, October the 24th. Make sure the 13 times is 9 3. Zero wins for Cambor. 12 was the final And we've got one draw, of course. Uh, Cambor, though, coming to his three wins and three defeats past six. 50% form. However, final back to back games without a win. But of course, just one defeat last six. 75% form for them at the moment. Uh, of course, that's the pleasure that Cambo was a 2 win four uh, final that was in the KNBB Becker. That's of course back in 2019. That's the pleasure in the league in Cambo. It was all the way back in 2015 when final picked up the W as well. Final coming to us on the back of that draw against Warwick. Uh, Cambo coming to us on the back of that loss to Sittard. And uh, final will be your favourites. 13 8 on for the victory. 4 1 is your host. 10 3 is your draw. Uh, Going to go with 3 0 win, brother. That's right. For uh, final to take it to the house. Into the back end on this one. We've got Groningen now coming up against AZ Outmar, of course. Uh, Groningen are struggling. AZ Outmar are starting into kicking the gear. Pushing the 15 times. Since 1996, 13 wins for Gruningen, 24 wins for AZ, and 13 draws. Of course, the biggest uh, win for Gruningen over AZ was a 3 0 win. The biggest win the other way was a 4 1 win. Uh, Gruningen without a win in six. Uh, however, back to back games without a loss. Uh, as, for, as for AZ, they kept it four wins on the bounce. 67% form for them at the moment. That's that pressure over in Gruningen. That uh, was a 0 0 draw back in May 2021. AZ, Alma competition on the back of that win. Over Utrecht, 5 1 win it was. Uh, Gruningen back to back draws for them. Uh, haven't won uh, in a long time. I'm going back, going back, going back. Uh, since opening day. They haven't won since opening day. Against Cambo. Uh, look at the odds on this one. Grudigan 65 for the victory point. 5 to 4 on is your AZ. 35 is draw. The away team is your favourites. That's where I'm going with a 3 1 win. In the end, kick it off forward though is VAT's Arnhem. They're going to be taking on Go Ahead Eagles. That's right. This takes place also on Sunday over at the uh, Geller Drone. Finish the 13 times. It's 3 8 wins for VAT's. 1 win for Go Ahead Eagles and 4 draws. Biggest win for VAT's. 5 0 win. The biggest win the other way was a 3 0 win. Uh, VAT's just won the feet past 5 for them. Meanwhile, just one win in uh, 5 also for Go Ahead Eagles. 50% form for them up against VAT. Uh, 58% form for VATs. That's the picture that over at the uh, Geller Drone was a 2 0 win for VATs back in 2016. Uh, VATs coming to us on back to back wins, picking up wins against Feyenoord and Nijmegen. Uh, meanwhile, uh, Go Ahead Eagles coming to us unbeaten, of course, in the last three, picking up two draws and a win to boot. Look at the odds 2 to 1 on is your, is your host, 7 to 2 is your, is your draw, 5 to 1 is your Go Ahead Eagles.
Uh, I'm going to go with the host on this one. 2 1 win in the end. And then we have the Bobby Dazzler at the end there. PSV, you go to Ajax. That's right. This coming Sunday as well. All eyes on this one, you would think. They each other uh, at the Johan Cruyff Arena. 6 4 times, though. Uh, it's 9 9 3. 22 wins for Ajax. 26 wins for PSV and 16 draws. Biggest win for Ajax. 5 1 win. The biggest win, otherwise, a 4 0 win. Uh, coming at you, though, Ajax just won the past six games in all competitions. Meanwhile, just won the past five uh, for Ajax. And 67% form for them at the moment. Uh, of course, last time I played over at the Ajax was in the Johan Cruyff Charles. It was a 4 0 win for Ajax. Sorry, a 4 0 win for, for PSV. Uh, last time I played in the league, though, um, at, uh, at the end of the division, it was a 1 0 win for Ajax over in this uh, scrap. That it was a 2 2 draw back in January 2021. Uh, of course, PSV comes in winning a Swalla 3 1 win. Meanwhile, Ajax comes in back at that win over Hell and Bean. Uh, we have odds on this one 7 4 on is your Ajax, 4 1 is your away win, and to 3 is your draw. Let's go on with the gold fest here. Going to go with 5 gold. We're going to favor Ajax 3 2 in the end. And that, my friends, will complete my picks. Be sure to get your own picks, of course, using the code cutly for slash Dutch. It is free to enter. It's all better, 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 better banter. But of course, there is prizes. And of course, honor at stake. Be sure to give the video some love and smash your thumbs up, smash your subscribe. Check out the links down below on Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, and of course, Patreon as well. But until then, I'll see you soon. Until then, we're donezo. All as they say in the Dutch lands, Ada Blader, donezo.